Ever wondered who the world's highest paid artists are? Well, today we'll uncover the truth. From rock legends to modern day moguls, the spectrum of wealth in the world of entertainment is as varied as it is fascinating. We're about to embark on a journey through the fortunes of the creative world, revealing the incredible earnings of some of your favorite artists. So, buckle up, as we start this journey from the least to the most paid artist. Starting off our countdown, at number 8, we have the legendary James Cameron. Known for directing some of the highest grossing movies of all time, Cameron's wallet certainly isn't lacking. His recent triumph, Avatar The Way of Water, has further solidified his place in cinematic history, netting him a cool $95 million. This accomplishment places Cameron at the helm of three of the most successful films ever, joining the ranks of his previous blockbusters, Avatar and Titanic. Switching gears to the world of music, at number seven, we find the iconic Rolling Stones. Their exceptional music and electrifying performances have kept them in the limelight for decades. Last summer, Mick Jagger, Keith Richards, and the rest of the band embarked on a 15-city tour across Europe. The tour grossed an impressive $136 million, with the Stones pocketing over $8.5 million per night, according to concert tracker Polestar. But it's not just touring that fills their coffers. The Rolling Stones continue to earn significant income from their extensive discography, proving that their timeless music still strikes a chord with fans around the globe. From the world of film to the stage of rock and roll, these artists have certainly made their mark. Their immense earnings are testament to their undeniable talent and enduring appeal. But as we'll soon see, they are not alone in their financial success. Moving up the ladder, at number six, we have Hollywood star Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt, the ever charismatic and versatile actor, made a considerable splash in the financial waters last year. His majority sale of his Plan B production company in December earned him an estimated $113 million after fees. This deal had tongues wagging across Hollywood. One lawyer commented on Plan B's status saying, it's definitely become a brand. The company has produced Oscar winners such as Moonlight, 12 Years a Slave, and Martin Scorsese's The Departed. These high-profile projects have likely increased the value of Plan B. Despite this, some have their reservations. As one attorney pointed out, the company produces projects rather than owning them. But whatever the case, Brad Pitt has certainly proven his worth, both in front of and behind the camera. Moving on to the world of animation, we find ourselves in the company of James L. Brooks and Matt Groening, the creative minds behind America's favorite yellow cartoon family, The Simpsons. In an impressive streaming deal back in April 2019, all 30 seasons of The Simpsons were migrated to Disney, plus from FX. This was after Disney's acquisition of Fox for a staggering $52 billion. According to sources familiar with the deal, Series co-creators Brooks and Groening have been earning an unreported $105 million annually after fees. It's safe to say they aren't having a cow, man. It's fascinating how these artists have navigated their careers. Brad Pitt, from his iconic roles to his ventures in production, and James L. Brooks and Matt Groening, with their enduring and globally loved animated series. From the silver screen to the world of animation, these artists continue to entertain us while raking in the big bucks. Taking the fourth spot, we have the comedic geniuses Trey Parker and Matt Stone. These masterminds behind the cultural phenomenon South Park have truly struck gold in the world of entertainment. With their wicked sense of humor and sharp social commentary, they've amassed a fortune of $160 million. An impressive chunk of their earnings comes from a legacy deal with HBO Max and their critically acclaimed musical, The Book of Mormon, which takes a comedic jab at the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. But the real cherry on top is their Paramount deal, signed in 2021, which guarantees them a whopping $935 million over six years. Talk about laughing all the way to the bank. But let's not forget about the man who's a jack of all trades and master of, well, all. Tyler Perry, the actor-director-writer studio mogul, has proven that wearing many hats can indeed be lucrative. Perry's diverse income streams, spanning film, television, and his own production backlot in Atlanta, 
have earned him a place in the Forbes top 10 highest paid entertainers for the second year running. With an estimated fortune of $1 billion, Perry is the only billionaire on this list. What makes Perry, Parker and Stone stand out is not just their incredible financial success, but also their ability to push the boundaries of entertainment. They've each carved out their own niche, redefined what's possible in their respective fields, and in the process, inspired millions of fans around the world. These artists haven't just made a mark on the entertainment industry, they've also set the bar incredibly high when it comes to earnings. Between Parker and Stone's clever business moves and Perry's entrepreneurial spirit, they've shown that creativity and business acumen can go hand in hand. And in doing so, they've not only redefined entertainment, but also set new standards in earning. And finally, at the top of our list, we have the iconic Sting. This 17-time Grammy winner and former frontman of The Police, known for hits such as Every Breath You Take and Roxanne, made a substantial windfall in 2022. Sting pocketed a staggering $300 million before fees by selling his entire musical output, both solo and with The Police, to Universal Music Group. As one longtime industry attorney commented on the British singer's work, it's a good catalogue, wouldn't mind owning it. Next, we move to Genesis. These pioneers of progressive rock had an exceptional 2022, topping off the year with a $300 million music rights sale to Concord Music Group in September. This deal included publishing rights, a selection of recorded music income streams from the group, and solo income streams from band members Phil Collins, Tony Banks, and Mike Rutherford. The deal even encompassed income from Phil Collins's hit song, In the Air Tonight. Touring and recorded music royalties further boosted their income, making Genesis one of the highest paid artists in the world. The success of Sting and Genesis is a testament to their enduring talent and decades of hard work. They've created a legacy with their music that continues to resonate with fans old and new alike. Their achievements are a reminder of the power of music and the impact it can have on people's lives. The earnings of these artists are not just from their music sales, but also from their savvy business decisions. They've shown that understanding the business side of the music industry is just as important as creating the music itself. Their deals and business ventures serve as a blueprint for other artists looking to maximize their earnings. So there you have it, Sting and Genesis, two giants of the music industry, showing us how it's done. These artists have proven that with talent and hard work, the sky is the limit. Before we wrap up, Let's give an honorable mention to an artist that's changing the music industry, Drake. Known for his catchy hip-hop and R&B tunes, Drake is a force to be reckoned with in the music scene. From his humble beginnings in Toronto to becoming a global sensation, his rise to fame has been nothing short of phenomenal. With a net worth estimated in the hundreds of millions, Drake's earnings are impressive, to say the least. But it's not just about the money. His influence extends beyond his wealth. His innovative approach to music and his knack for setting trends have been pivotal in shaping the industry. He's won numerous awards and his songs consistently top the charts. His ability to connect with his audience on a deep level is also noteworthy. Drake's impact on music is undeniable, making him a game changer in the industry. While he might not be on this list, Drake is definitely one to watch. So there you have it, the world's highest paid artists, from the pioneering rock legends Genesis, who topped the charts with a whopping $230 million, to the 17-time Grammy winner Sting, who pocketed a cool $210 million. Let's not forget about the multi-talented Tyler Perry, raking in an impressive $175 million, and the comedic genius of Trey Parker and Matt Stone, who amassed a substantial $160 million. And who could overlook The Simpsons creators, James L. Brooks and Matt Groening, who earned a tidy $105 million. Hollywood heartthrob Brad Pitt wasn't far behind, with a solid $100 million, followed closely by rock icons, the Rolling Stones, and acclaimed director James Cameron. And of course, the honorable mention goes to Drake, who continues to change the music industry one beat at a time. Remember, art is priceless, but sometimes it can also be quite pricey. Thanks for watching.